ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೇ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬೃಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕಿಪಾಸಿಂದುಭವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಂಬ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮುಖಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂ ಬಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಶ್ನವಕ್ತಿ ವದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನೊರಂ ಚೈವನೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸ್ವರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುಧೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಚನು ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೇತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತ ಬಾಲಭವಾಧಿಪೋತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರುಣ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫೋರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸ ಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬುದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರ ಕಮಲಾಹ್ಯಸ್ಥಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರೌ ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ವಾಮಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಗುರುಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಯಶ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
श्री विष्णु श्रवण परीक्षित अभवत वैयासकीर्तने प्रहलाद स्मरण तदंग्री भजन लक्ष्य पृथु पूजने अक्रूढ़स्तु अभिवंदन कपिपतिर्दे यथो साक्ष्य अर्जुन सर्वात्म निवेदने बलिभूतृष्णाशा परम श्री विष्णु श्रवणे परीक्षित अभवत वैयासकीर्तने प्रहलाद स्मरण तदंग्री भजन लक्ष्य पृथु पूजने अक्रूढ़स्तु अभिवंदन कपिपतिर्दे अथो साक्ष्य अर्जुन अर्जुन सर्वात्म निवेदने बलिभूत कृष्णाशा परम गौरीय गोष्ठीपति <coughs> गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत तो सरस्वती गोस्वामी जग भोपाल जगदगुरु टोल्ड दैट कृष्ण इज अधक्ष जो वस्तु सो बाय द हेल्प ऑफ मेटेरियल सेंस ऑर्गन वी कैन नॉट नो द सुप्रीम लॉर्ड Somebody putting question in front of Gauri Agasti Pati Sri Sri Lavakti Sri Dham to Saraswati Goswami Dagar Bhopal. Somebody putting question: Why, why we cannot see Krishna? Why we cannot see Supreme Lord? What can be the reason? Bhopal giving an answer: Krishna is adhaksha jabastu. So by the help of material sense organs and mind. it is impossible to know krishna and most of us trying that way krishna is not at all an object of enjoyment krishna is not an object of enjoyment krishna is not an object of our enjoyment he is the only supreme enjoyer he is a supreme enjoyer and all infinity world is an object of his enjoyment we are aversive to krishna that's why our darshan our paji our darsh our dirty darshan cannot allow us to see krishna jatha yatha atma parimijyate aso matpunna gatha savano vidhanai तथा तथा पश्यति वस्तु सूक्ष्म चक्षुशव अंजन संप्रजुक्त भगवान श्री कृष्ण स्पीकिंग टू उद्धव उद्धव द मोर द मोर आ जीवात्मा कैन हियर हरि कथा द मोर ही कैन गेट क्लियर क्लियरिटी टू सी कृष्ण बिकॉज बाय दिस मे डी आईज वी कैन नॉट सी कृष्ण The more we can hear Hari Katha with full intention, full intensity, full interest, the more we can hear Hari Katha. The more we can develop fine darshan, accurate darshan, we can develop. Yatha yatha atma parimajjata so matpunna gatha sabano vidhanai tatha tatha pashati pasu sukshmam chakshu shivo anjana sam prajuktam. like in our childhood we used to apply black in our eyes so that is to increase the vision power mother used to apply black in our eyes to help us to increase our vision power but what kind of vision i'm speaking here is called fine darshan it is not material darshan i'm speaking about Fine darshan, accurate darshan. What is what, as it is there, in the transcendental world. So, if we can go on hearing Hari Katha from the lotus mouth of Guru Vishnu, then we can, we can eliminate all our anartha, and we can go ahead in the way of Krishna darshan. Krishna darshan or lalasa, lalasa means tre tremendous, and. Uh, I know it's tremendous, you know, interest. Tremendous, you know, demand to see Krishna, but we have no demand. 
Because we know in economics one word is there. Demand and supply oscillating factor in economics. If demand is not there, then supply can never be met. In foreign economy, all economy depends on oscillating factor. According to demand, supply, you know, increasing. According to demand, supply increasing. If demand going down, supply also going down. So, we have no demand. Like Gaurkishwar Babaji Maharaj speaking, like Gaurkishwar Babaji Maharaj speaking to a Grihastha devotee, Banaprastha, he claim, he is going to claim that he is Banaprastha. Gaurkishwar Babaji Maharaj asking, uh, well, where you are staying? But just near, at the bank of Ganga, we are making our bhajan kutir, and uh, staying. Okay, and your wife? Well, wife is staying separately. And what about cooking? Well, cooking actually we are doing uh, together. I mean, uh, wife cooking, I am thinking. Today what you take? Today actually moong dal, very fine moong dal, and fry, begun, begun, brinjal fry, fry, and so many things. Gorgisat Bhaji Maharaj speaking, how you are going to take, you know, dam streak and brinjal fry? How you how you are feeling interest to, to chew drumstick and how you are eating, you know, brinjal fry, whereas you are missing Krishna, the topmost property of this infinity world. You have no pain. You have no pain inside your heart that you are missing the topmost, you know, property. So you are leading your life as usual. So how you can get Krishna? So, Gaurkishwar Bhaji, some, somebody, 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 somebody asking to Gaurkishwar Bhaji Maharaj, Babaji Maharaj, how we can get darshan of Krishna? How we can get Krishna? Babaji Maharaj not speaking, uh, you know, so many Shastra documents. Only speaking, you will have to cry. If you can cry, if you can cry for Supreme Lord, Bhagavan, if you can cry, if you can cry from heart for Krishna, then surely you can get darshan, you can get Krishna. You have to cry. As you are crying for money loss, when you are going to lose some money, you are crying, my, all my money gone, oh my God. This way you are crying. So, you are crying if your children gone, husband gone, wife gone, son gone, daughter gone, this way, in the material world we find, we are feeling pain for, for being separated from a near and dear one. But we don't know Krishna is the only objective in our life. Krishna is the only objective of our love. That we don't know. So, Prabhupada speaking, due to our aversive attitude, we cannot get the chance, I mean our darshan, our present darshan cannot allow, our, cannot allow us to see Krishna. The maya employed by Krishna and the maya giving, you know, maya's function is two type, Toba speaking. Krishna going to employ maya devi. To, to give us treatment and Maya, Krishna Maya, his function is twofold, twofold. One is, she cannot allow us to see Krishna, she cannot allow us to see Krishna. Another is that, he can, he can, he can displace Krishna from your place. Krishna ke sariya dava. First of all, cannot allow you to see Krishna. And another is he can he can take away Krishna from you. Sariyada. Only this kind of disadvantage, this kind of acute problem we can we can solve by the help of authentic sadhu, exalted sadhu, Guru Vaishnava. When Kulingram, one village, in Chaitanya Chaitamita you can find, 
in Kulingram, some devotees came to join Ratha Yatra Utsav. Kulingram Bashi, Shattaraj Khan, you can remember, he go through Chaitanya Jyotva Ratha Yatra, he can buy. That Kulingram, those who are living in Kulin village, Kulingram in Kulin village, Kulingram, some devotees coming to join Ratha Yatra to, to meet Mahaprabhu, to serve Mahaprabhu. They are asking so many questions, I have no time to discuss, but this much I can say. What is the answer of Krishna, of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? How we can get Krishna? Mahaprabhu speaking, Krishna Seva, Krishna Seva, I mean Vaishnava Seva, Krishna Seva, Krishna Seva, Krishna Seva, Krishna Seva, I mean Vaishnava Seva, follow, follow. And Nam Sankirtan. Jivas, those who are doing bhajan, they must do all the three. All this, this, all these three. One is Krishna Seva, Krishna Seva, my Guru Vaishnava Seva, and Nam Sankirtan, three. Bhajaniya Vastu, Bhagavan. Bhagavan is the only worship of our. Bhagavan is the only object of our worship. But we are worshipping so many things. We are worshipping Devi Maya, Sankar, Ganesh to get some facility. You know, we are going to chant some mantra of Ganesh either to get material. Faith. This is called Anavilas, Anartha. It can prove that you have Anartha. You can never get success this way. So, Annavilasita Sunyam. First of all, we have to go. And Bhajan Vritti, and a devotee, his nature, a devotee, his nature is devotion. A devotee, his nature is devotion. Bhajan Vritti. So, Bhakti. Bhakta and Bhagavan all should be in all three eternal factor. So all these three should be in one platform. So then we can get help. Then we can start actual Hari Bhajan. We are contaminated. We are cont our heart is contaminated. Different kind of you know things we are doing. Not that only pure Hari. Pure devotional practice. We are doing so many things, complicated. There is contamination in our effort, in our activities. So that's why Krishna, Krishna is not an object of realization. So that is why Krishna at present is not an object of realization. We cannot realize. You know, Mishra, mixed effort. Our Misra Pachesta, Misra means mixed, mixed effort, mixed, mixed effort. We are Kapat. We are speaking, we are speaking, we are, we are speaking, merely we are speaking, we are Krishna Bhakta, we are worshipping Krishna. We are the servant of Krishna, but actually not that. We are the servant of our sense of man. We are the servant of Maya. We are the servant of all material sense objectives. So long as a uh, so long as a so-called devotee, so long as a so-called devotee not going to develop pure devotional practice, till then he cannot get any clear conception about Krishna, Tatta, Krishna, nothing can arrive. Hmm. Prabhupada speaking, this is simply because, Prabhupada speaking, this is sim this condition how developed? Prabhupada speaking, this is simply because, this is simply because we are not going to pay attention to all advice of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Krishna. Our only duty is to serve Krishna and Krishna devotee, Harinam, Sankirtan, and everything. So long as we cannot realize this, our duty, 
the, as a devotee we must serve Krishna, Krishna and Nam Sankirtan, till then there is no possibility. We are not going to show, we are not going to show our 100% submission unto the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, I mean unto the lotus feet of Krishna. That's why we are not going to get any facility. Continuously, Hari Bhajan is very... Guru Padma used to say, Guru Padma used to say, the tail of a street dog is bent round. Guru Padma used to give the example, but Guru Padma used to give the example, though repeatedly Guru Vishnu going to advise, my son, my daughter, try to rectify your life this way, but they are not going to pay any attention. Guru Vishnu giving advice, try to rectify. Guru Padma used to speak the, 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 the tail, the tail of a dog is round, bent. You apply ghee, you apply ghee or oil, try to massage the whole tail of the, of the dog to make it straight. But anyway, the tail is bent, round, again round. So, it is also the advice of Prabhupada. And I heard this advice from Guru Pat Padma, my son, like the tail, like the, like the bent tail of a dog can never and you know, can never be made straight by the application of oil and ghee, everything you can mess it. This way, all bondage so they are not going to pay attention to the advice of Guru Vaishnav. Anyway, they are going to criticize Guru Vaishnav, Sampraday, this, that, have some hatred, I mean some jealousy against pure Guru Vaishnav, and at the same time they have the tendency to find out some fault in them, have some jealousy, everything. So this way they are actually, they are kapat. So they are kapat this way, whatever advice Guru Vaishnav given, whatever advice Guru Vaishnav giving for their benefit, not going to get entry into the inside their heart. And at the same time, you forget, we, we forget that we are going to follow Bhagavad Dharma. We forget that we are going to follow Bhagavad Dharma, whereas it is written in Bhagavatam, Nirma Saranam Satam. Dharma Pajjito Kaitavatra Parama Nirma Saranam Satam, Veddam Bastava Matra Vastu, Shivadam Tapatraya Unumilanam. You know, there is Bhagavad Sloka. So in the beginning it is written, it is actually Nirma Sat Dharma. If there is slight contamination, if there is slight, you know, jealousy, we cannot come out sakti because Bhagavad, Srimad Bhagavad Mahapuran, Sri Chaitanya Charitamito, all the property of, you know, pure sadhu. Actually, we can, under the guidance of Guru Vaj, we can try, but it is actually Srimad Bhagavatam Purana Tilakam Yad Vaishnavanam Dhanam. It is written in Bhagavad Glorification and in Bhagavatam also, a, a, a twelfth chapter it is written. Srimad Bhagavatam Purana Tilakam Yat Vaishnavanam Dharam. It is, it is the sole property, it is the sole property of pure Guru Vishnu. In Bhagavatam and in the glorification of Bhagavatam, they are all, it is written. That it is the sole property of pure Guru Vishnu. If there is contamination, some demand, these are money we need, woman, money, position, these, they, all we are busy. In the name of Acharya Sip, in the name of, you know, you know, you know, we are doing all the time. This way we can never come out successful, you know, not possible. Whatever advice, you know, we can try, we can, we can exhibit, we can open, we can exhibit, we can open one demonstration, we can exhibit, we can open one demonstration, uh, we can open one exhibition that we are reading Bhagavad, we are reading Srimad Bhagavad Gita, Srimad Bhagavad Gita Mahapurana, also Chaitanya 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 Bhagavad, we are reading. And we are also doing uh, Sadhu Sangha, but we forget. that We forget that we will have to stop 
contamination. We will have to eliminate anartha, that we forget. We are reading Chaitanya we are going we are going to prove that we are doing satsanga. At the same time, we are not going to stop criticizing Guru Vishnu. We are not going to stop, you know, jealous attitude towards pure Guru Vishnu. Papa speaking, it is just like the needle, it is just like the needle of compass. You like to change the uh, direction, but a north direction plot, immediately the compass going to, going to, going to, you know, follow the north direction, north pole and south pole. You are going to change forcefully, but immediately tack going to change. Papa speaking, it is just like the needle compass. We are trying to change, but you cannot change immediately, you know. This way, life after life, we are going to take risks. This way, life after life, we are going to take risks. We are going to, we are going to run risks, you know, to, to lead this kind of material life, which is painful, which is really painful, you know. It is really painful, painful. We cannot take risks if you are really intelligent. That's it. That's why in, uh, in Upanishad it is written, Khurasya dhara nishi thaya durgam patastat kavayo vadanti in Upanishad. Eh? In Upanishad it is written, We are walking over a sharp-edged sword. Eh? The Sadhu Guru Vaishnava asking her, why you are not going to accept that property which is waiting for you? Eh? Uttishtata Jagrato, it is written, you know the slok. You know the slok, I think, in, in, in Upanishad. Uttishtata Jagrato, Prapa Bharana Nivodato. So many benediction, boon, waiting for you. So many property waiting, but why you are not interested to take it? Eh? It is a waiting for you. Uttishtata Jagrodhi, you are, you, are, you are lying unconscious. You are lying, you are lying unconscious. It, you are lying unconscious, it is not consciousness. It is not at all Krishna consciousness, not, not, not. It is not Krishna consciousness. You can claim that you are doing Krishna consciousness. It is not consciousness. They have some standard like mathematics. You cannot deny it. So Uttishtata Jagrata, Prabhupada, you can say we have consciousness. No, this is not consciousness. We have to develop our consciousness up to the, up to the mark said by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Purna Chaitanya Vastu. This is not consciousness. With this kind of consciousness, it is impossible to do Krishna Vajan. But foolish people don't, don't understand. Uttishtata Jagrata Prabhupada Bharana Nibodhato. You try to get back consciousness. Why you are sleeping unconscious? Try to break your sleep and discover that so many treasure waiting for you. Big treasure. Like you can remember Chaitanya Mahaprabhu giving advice to Sanatan, Sanatan, some Sarvagya who can count everything and speak past, present, and future. He is going to meet one innocent boy who is crying. Then the man asking, why you are crying? I, my, I was outside my village and my father dying, all property. They are my, my brothers, they are, they, they, are, they are taking all property. They are not giving me any share. Then there the you know, astrologer speaking, who told you? Not giving you property, you have the maximum most property, immense property is there waiting for you. Well, really, yes. He couldn't get the scope to inform you because you was you you are you as you are outside. So I know there is a property. Oh, where I can go? No, no, no. This way you cannot get. And uh, in the field, in the near the forest, you can get. No, I can go now. When you speak the spot. No. If you run like crazy, then big problem. What problem? Because in the south, there is one python can swallow you. In the north, 
there is big problem there is black bees can cut you and kill you oh really this way i know mahaprabhu speaking that if you go to the east direction follow and in the, in in the in the in the in the in the, in the west direction in the west direction there is one jaksha in the west direction if you try if you run there in the west direction and try to dig the land then there is one you know evil spirit there is an evil spirit evil this is called jaksha he can kill you oh really then but you will have to approach in east direction go on digging the mud go make a tunnel bed a canal and tunnel you go inside you can find there's a big treasure waiting for you oh this way as uh, this upanishad shloka also speaking uttishtata jagrata prapta varana nibodhato khurasya dhara nishitaya durgam patastat kavayo vadanti kavayo mean the wise you know sadhu guru vishnu great wise man you know they are going to advise us that you are going to waste your time you know follow uttishtata jagra jagrata prapta varana nibodhato khurasya dhara nishitaya durgam patastat is very typical very typical your life is so risky but you are leading your life like a crazy man you know full of danger any time we can try and kurashadar and jit durgam patastat kavayo vad kavayo mane your wise manishes now the shloka i started with is to remind you that all nine different kind of bhakti mode navavida bhakti and all we have our nine different acharyas in the field each one of them having some speciality in each line follow what i say as rain it is written sri vishnu shravane vishnu mean i mean krishna shravan i mean the topics of krishna or vishnu ha ah. sri vishnu shravane parikshit abhavat parikit is the acharya of shravanaksha bhakti hearing and vyasaki i am in the son of vyasadeva i mean sukadev goswami is the acharya of krita kirtanaksha bhakti prahlad is the acharya of saranaksha bhakti <coughs> and lakshmi devi Lakshmi Devi is the acharya of serving the leg, and Pithu Maharaj is the acharya of archana acha bhakti, akrura akrura, <coughs> akrura is the acharya of abhivandan, glorifying abhivandan, Kapipati Mata Hanumanji Maharaj is a famous. acharya in servitor sim dash dashya and in the in a friendship arjuna in the friendship arjuna be careful now and i am speaking about the friendship of arjuna which is which is which is you know mixed with appliances aishwarya mishra friendship is there but mix with i sorry <coughs> here we are not going to compare any brajavasi in this way because their case is totally ex- exclusive case that's why you know vishnu sobane parikshit even in the starting even in the starting here it is vishnu sobane not writing krishna sobane because Parikit Maharaj is bhajan is you know mixed with Aishar Jaba. That's why sometime about Rasa Lila, Venu Gita, Kaliya Dhawan, so many Krishna Lila. But still, Parikit Maharaj going to put question in front of Sukhdev Goswami. 
the how it is possible is the supreme lord sri krishna paratpara khileshwar and we know he is full of madhurya but this madhurya totally total madhurya is there in krishna so madhurya and aisharya follow and uh, so parikshit maharaj in uh, parikshit parikshit maharaj is standing on such a platform as uh, so that the writer here writing sukha basde ko swami i mean or sukha devo says speaking uh, uh, using one open term sri vishnu shravane parikshit abhavat vyas ki kirtane prahlad smarane tadangri bhajane lakshmi hi prithu pujane akrorastu abhivandane kapipadir dashe atho shakhe arjuna sarvatma nivedane bali abhut krishnaapti resha param why i am going to why i am going to touch this shloka because we know from the very beginning we are going to discuss so many comparative statement of bhakti by the endless mercy of sanatan gosai and by this time by now we already discussed so many point like you know we already discussed about parikshit maharaj we already discussed about you know uh, prahlad maharaj shiv ji maharaj you know lakshmi devi so many you know bali maharaj so many thing we already discussed about them so now actually previous week i was discuss i was discussing this point that naraji maharaj you know out of <coughs> up out of loveful feeling he shouting after hearing so many argument uh, so many thing you know after you know parikshit ma speaking naraji maharaj was describing so many thing and after that <coughs> after that after that what happens naraji maharaj going to reach sutalpuri to meet prahlad maharaj and shouting ho oh, vaishnava shreshto jito stayeti king bachyam mukundo bali napi nirjitaha pautrena daityo ganeshwarena te sangrakshit dari tava prasadatah naraji mara shouting and speaking hey vaishnav sesso hey topmost vaishnav you are really lucky you are successful you are successful to buy you are successful to buy the heart of krishna prabhu what to speak more about it even by your mercy by your influence of bhakti you are doing so nice bhakti even your grandson bali maharaj he is going to you know he uh, is you know he is also successful and uh, and bamandev maharaj i mean bhagwan is under his control going to stay as a gate man as a gate keeper in the gate man of bali maharaj's kingdom follow i mean palace <coughs> so uh, it is it is all your mercy it is all your mercy you see you know it is all your mercy what to speak more now actually out of ecstatic feeling naraji mara speaking oh i have taken decision oh i have taken decision to live in the sutalpuri with you i know though i know i am already getting one curse by daksha prajapati but still i think this kind of curse cannot be effective in the sutalpuri where your by your you know your devotional power i think it is free of that kind of you know problem so i have taken decision to stay with you prahlad in your sutalpuri you know ataha प्रभीति है न अद्यतनाथ प्रभीति मीन फ्रॉम टूडे ऑनवर्ड प्रभीति है न फॉलो प्रभीति मीन 
<coughs> in Bengali, pravriti mean etc. But in Sanskrit, pravriti mean you know since you know. So ataha pravriti from today onward from ataha pravriti kartabhyo nivaso niyato atrohi. I have taken decision. It is the it is it is you know you know it is the duty. I should live here with you. Because this place is, you know, very nice place. You know. So, Ataha Praviti Kartabhyo. It is my duty to stay here. Nivaso Niyato. Continuously, non-stop, I should stay here. Maya Vibhuyo Dakshadi Shapam Jushmat Prabhavato. I think by your, I think by your influence. By the power of your devotional practice, by the power of your devotional mode, Krishna love you so much, and and the place in you know, environment totally changed. If I stay here with you, permanent, I think the curse given by Daksha is not effective here. So I have taken decision to stay here. Now Parikhit Maharaj is going to explain in, in front of mother before leaving body. Mother Uttara, Uttara, mother Uttara hearing and Parikhit Maharaj is going to speak the gist you know, of you know, Bhagavatam. Parikhit Maharaj speaking. Parikhit Maharaj speaking. So, Parikhit Maharaj Parikhit Si Parikhit Uvacho. So, Slagha Asahana Shakti, you know. Acha. It is written, try to hear. Sha Slagha Asahana Shakti, Lajjavo No Mita, Lajjavo Mita Nana. Again I am reading. Sha Slagha Sha Slagha. Sahana Shakti Lajjavo Lajjavo Nomita Nanaha Perlado Na Perlado Narodam Natya Gaurabad Abadat Abadat Chanai. Again I am reading. Sha Slaga Sahana Shakti Lajjavo Nato Lajjavo Nomita Nanaha Lajjavo Lajjavo Mi. Lajjava Namita Nanaha Prahlado Naradam Natya Gaurabad Abad Gaurabad Abadat Chanai Sha Slagya Sana Shakti Lajjava Namita Nanaha Prahlado Naradam Natva Gaurabad Abadat Chanai now the meaning thereby, Parikhid Mahara speaking, Prahlad, after hearing personal glorification, he is feeling disgusted. He cannot be here. Because naturally they are humble. They don't like to hear any personal you know, glorification. Anyway, Gurudev speaking, Naraji Maharaj is Guru. He cannot speak. He cannot make him stop. So Prahlad Maharaj, after hearing Sila Pallad Maharaj, after hearing all personal glorification from the lotus mouth of Gurudev, he cannot just bear it. Then he is going to shrug his head. He is going, his head, you know, he is putting his head down, shrugging his head. And after paying Dandavat Pranam to Naraji Maharaj, Speaking very, very slowly because Naraji Maharaj is Gurudev. In front of Gurudev, in front of Gurudev, one should not shout, one should not speak with audacity. So, naturally, Prahlad Maharaj is very humble. So, now Prahlad Maharaj is going to, going to, going to pay prostrated Dandavad, going to shrug his head. In front of Gurudev Naraji Maharaj, and due to his due to his you know 
glory of Gurudev. He is going to glorify Gurudev, but before that, you know, going to uh, pay Dhanavad and going to speak very slowly with full efficacy and dignity. <coughs> so, Parikhid Vacho, Sha Slagha Sahana Shakti Lajjava Namita Nanaha Pralhada Naradam Natva Gaurava Dabadachanai. Now, Pralhada Vacho, what Pralhada is speaking? First of all, Pralhada cannot, you know, object. Pralhada cannot object di directly because Naraji Maharaj is Guru. See, in front of Guru, you should speak very, with full dignity. So, though Guru is speaking that way, he is unbearable for him, he, don't, he, is not, he is cannot bear it, but still, with full efficacy and dignity. Now, Prahlad Mahara is going to speak, Bhagavan, see Guru, Sarvam Sayameva Vicharjotam, with full dignity and honor, going to speak in a very humble way. O oh, Gurudev, Bhagavan Gurudev, Se Guru, you yourself can, you know, think over and again. I know you are glorifying, but you are Guru. Maybe you are testing me, who can say? So Gurudev, please, you know, you try to think over and again. Maybe you are going to test me with this kind of glorification. Huh? Gurudev, Bhagavan Se Guru, Sarvam Sayam Evabhi, you yourself try to, you know, past judgment you are giving, you are speaking so many you are doing so many glorification about me but you yourself try to you know think over and again because in because in childhood because i am very 5 years boy childhood and in childhood very small age it is quite natural that a small boy cannot understand the full science of bhakti of krishna it's quite natural. You are glorifying me. I have done so many things. Nishinga they bless you. Nishinga they pray, put your hand over your head. So many things you are speaking. And you are not you are going to ignore all different kind of boon. Nishinga they want it. Okay, okay, okay. But try to think, Gurudev. You are glorifying me. You try to think yourself. You are wise personality. You are great, you know, you know, Parshada Bhagavan. You try to think over and again about what all you have already spoken about me. I was only five years boy, and five years boy, you an know, innocent boy. How, how a small innocent boy can have the total science of bhakti? A small boy, innocent boy, have no idea about bhakti. Anyway, so hey guru, you try to think over and again. That was my childhood. In my very small boy, I know. What I can know about Krishna Bhakti? Even that natural maturity also not growing that time. So you are going to glorify that way. Follow. Pallad Maharaj, after hearing all the glorification of Gurudev from the lotus mouth of Gurudev, as if Pallad Maharaj going to dip into the ocean of sinus. As if, as if, as if Prahlad Maharaj is going to jump into the ocean of sinus. Oh, Lajja, 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 Sai, Sai. How you are speaking? Maybe you are testing. Who can say? Gurudev, you know, testing me. You know, Prahlad Maharaj thinking. Prahlad Maharaj thinking, maybe Gurudev testing me. To see that actual humbleness I have or not, maybe for this reason. And after hearing Prahlad Maharaj as if going to jump into the ocean of sinus. Paishanno Bhavano Piruto. Follow this sloka from Chaitanya Chaitamita. Follow. Vaigunno ki takalito. Vaigunno ki takalito. Paishanno Bhavano Piruto. Dainar no be nimag no ham si chaitan no be idhamasray. Who's speaking? Who's speaking? Who's speaking? Sri Lakshmidas Kabiraj Goswami. He is speaking. I am totally affected by 
by the beastly behavior, beastly conception, poison no brono prito, you know, bowels, you know, bowels, you know, fora, you know, very poisonous, you know, it become very poisonous, you know, like brown, brown, you know, young man, those who are developing some, you know, some, you know, problem in the face there, that is called Bruno, you know. So this way, this way, Krishnadath Kaviraj Goswami is speaking very humble way. Not very humble way. This kind of humbleness, we even in dream we cannot think. Poison no Bruno Prito. I am affected by the poisonous, you know, seal in my face. Poison no Brono Pirito, Boyguno Kitukulito, all different kind of bad qualities there. Poison no Brono, all beastly, beastly character there in me. I am affected totally. My real self already, already, you know, affected very. Poison no Brono Pirito, you know, Poison no Brono Pirito, Boyguno Kitukulito, Boyguno many different kind of bad qualities there, all anartha there, vaigunno kit kolito, kit, or like bookworm. Bookworm, for a long time, if you, are not, if you are not going to touch any book, then the big bookworm can eat up all the vitals of the book. So you see, all the vitals of the book, bookworm, bookworm, bookworm can eat up all the vitals of the book. Bookworm can eat up all the vitals of the book. You cannot read that book. So this way, like bookworm, that you know all the bad qualities, like you know animal, all going to eat up all my vitals of my real self. I am a beggar. Krishna Kaviraj Goswami is speaking. Boyguno ki to kulito, poishunno brono pirito, doinar na I am going to jump. I am going. I am going to jump. I am going to jump into the ocean of shyness, in humbleness. Follow. What is the mood of those who are elevated devotees, pure Shadu Guru Vishnu? Their humbleness, if 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 their humbleness is going to touch our heart, instant we can change our mood. Though I know I am a beast, but still instant if I watch. The humble attitude of Bhakti Pumaturi Goswami Maharaj or Srila Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, they never express this kind of adversity. They never speak, I am a big prachar, I have done so, never. Whereas their quality, Bhagavan cannot count their quality. Even Bhagavan Krishna Chaitanya cannot count their quality of Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Pumaturi Goswami Maharaj, but they are saying, we have done nothing. There is called actual humbleness. So, Krishna Das Kavira Goswami is going to jump into the ocean of humbleness, you know, and here our Prahlad Maharaj is going to jump into the ocean of, you know, shyness. So, Prahlad Maharaj speaking, He Bhagavan, He Gurudev, He Bhagavan, Sri Guru, He Bhagavan, Sri Guru, Sarvam sayameva vicharjyotam. It is one kind of, one kind of logic. <laughs> because Purlatma anyway cannot fight with Gurudev. You are speaking wrong. But logical interpretation, very, very, uh, you know, aprakita, uh, aprakita, a transcendental logic, going to speak. You, oh Gurudev, you, 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 you think yourself. You are glorifying me. Because you are going to test me, I think. Or you love me, who can say? Otherwise, how you are speaking? So, objection is very sweet here. Though Prahladma is going to object, but the mood of objection is so sweet, so sweet, that we cannot explain. Bhagavan si guru ho, Bhagavan si guru sarvam. Try to hear. Bhagavan si guru sarvam, sayameva vipchar jatam. What speaking? Prahlad Maharaj. 
भगवान श्री गुरो सर्व स्वयं विचर्जता बालो न संभव कृष्ण भक्तर ज्ञानमी स्फुटम आरे गुरुदेव इन चाइल्ड हुड आई वॉज देन फाइव इयर्स वॉन इवन क्लियरली मै कन्सियसनेस कन्सियसनेस वॉज नॉट क्लियर so how it is you can expect that that time i was doing krishna bhakti it is the humbleness nothing else because we know devotional factor devotion never devotion devotion never depend upon age factor we know it very well it is simply it is simply the humbleness of prahlad maharaj it is very good it is very good we we uh, we have the scope to learn humbleness from prahlad man but actually siddhant is there bhakti is not dependent upon age factor or educational factor or hereditical factor you know nothing nothing it is it is just neutral bhakti devi bhakti devi is neutral it is the humbleness of prahlad man so speaking that way but we know the siddhanta that it is impossible you know because bhakti devi bhakti devi never depend upon age factor hereditary factor educational factor or bodily capacity factor or i am very handsome looking or beautiful looking not that janmai sajjo suto sivi redo mano madah apmano नैव अर्हति अभिदातुम वै तम किंचन गोचर कुंती देवी स्पीकिंग ना ऑल द फोर फैक्टर्स ऑल दिस ऑल दिस फोर फैक्टर्स ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ विच ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ विच यूजली बॉन्ड इट्स ऑल गोइंग टू एक्सप्रेस फॉल्स सिगो नाउ कुंती देवी स्पीकिंग जन्म ऐश्वर्य जन्म ऐश्वर्य श्रुत सीवी रे दो मान मद भगवान यूजली पीपल बिकम फुल ऑफ फॉल्स इगो बिकॉज इफ दे हैव वन ऑफ द फोर फैक्टर्स और इफ एट ऑल दे हैव फोर देन मेनी नीति शास्त्र ऑल्सो आई टोल्ड नीति शास्त्र ऑल्सो आई टोल्ड यू कैन रिमेम्बर है किमुतो यत्त चतुष्टयम फॉलो एक कोई कम अभी अनर्थ आयो इफ वन आउट ऑफ द फोर क्वालिटीज इज देयर इट कैन ब्रिंग डेंजर इन माई लाइफ वॉट टू स्पीक अबाउट ऑल द फोर हाँ फॉलो वन इज ए इफ वन सच क्वालिटी सपोज आई एम टेकिंग बर्थ इन ए हाई फैमिली मे बी मे बी मे बी मे बी आई हैव वेरी हाई एजुकेशनल क्वालिफिकेशन मे बी माई बॉडीली स्ट्रक्चर इज वेरी गुड A very handsome looking, maybe. Eh? Educational qualification very high. This way, all four factors, all these four factors can be there with me. Whereas only one factor, if there, it is more than danger. Follow. Eko ekoi kam opi honor thayo. if only one quality i have taken birth in high family for that reason i can develop false ego if i am not vaishnav so if four qualities they have money very beautiful body structure very educational quality high then what is it so in niti in niti shastra in niti shastra it is written ekoi kam opi anar thai एक ही कम ओपी आना होता है कि मुतो यक्तर चतुष्टयम ये फोर क्वालिटीज दे देन नॉट टू स्पीक एनीथिंग अबाउट दैट सो कुंती देवी स्पीकिंग जन्म ईश्वर्य सुतो सीवी रे दो मानो मद हप मानो नैव अर्हति नैव अर्हति अभिदातुम भई तम किंचन गोचरम हो प्रभु नोबडी कैन सी यू नोबडी कैन डू परफेक्ट भजन बिकॉज जन्म ईश्वर्य सुतो सी ए सच फैक्टर्स आर गोइंग टू ब्रिंग सम फॉल्स इन साइड हार्ड ऑफ बॉन्ड सर बॉन्ड इट सॉल्व एंड ओनली दोज निस्किंचन साधुज ओनली दोज हुआ निस्किंचन साधु हम्बल साधुज 
for them Krishna bhajan is possible. Or other people cannot do Krishna bhajan. Impossible. Or next to impossible. Tamakinjana <coughs> Gocharam. You are known, you become known in front of those pure devotees, those who are not, those who are devoid of false ego, you know, nothing. Only you manifest your secret, you know, feature in front of them. Like in Chaturshraki Bhagavata also you know, in front of Pitama Brahma, Bhagavan speaking, Javanaham Jatha Bhavayad Rupa Guna Karma Kaha Tathaiva Tattva Vigyana Mastu Te Madanu Madanu Graha Javanaham Jatava, how I am, what is my feature, what is my, you know, vichar, judgment, what is my and lila, all everything you can know. When? You per, by, your, by, your, by, your, by your personal effort, by your, by your personal effort, you can never come out successful. So I am going to bless you. Bhagavan speaking to Brahma, Javanaham Jatha Bhavo. What is the excellent, what is the excellent, you know, glory of my Harinam, my Leela, my Parikar, Paraparnaliya, what is my idea, all my picture, everything, how I am looking like, all you can know. Javanaham yatha bhavo yad rupa guna karma kaha tathaiva vijyanam astu, tathaiva vijyanam astu te madanugraha. By my mercy, by my by my causeless mercy, you can know everything. This science, this science, by your personal effort, you can never know. You can never know. So you see, now Prahlad was speaking, that was my very small, I was a kid. And I was a very small kid. That time, how devotional factors can develop, you are going to glorify me. But we know it for sure, it is the humble attitude of Pallad Maharaj. Usually, now not usually, a Bhakti Devi is neutral, never depend upon where to go, where not to go. It never depends upon this hereditary factor, educational factor, bodily, you know, feature, nothing. Nothing. Because Bhakti Devi is Neutral, very neutral. So, we cannot accept, though Pallad Maharaj, though Pallad Maharaj out of his humble attitude going to give some argument, out of his humble attitude, but we know it first here. Pallad Maharaj giving argument because to defend himself, <laughs> to defend himself, but we know his humbleness, nothing else. So, we cannot accept this Siddhanta. We know, uh, so what, five years age, for five years old, Prahlad Maharaj, so what? We cannot accept this Siddhanta. Anyway, it is a simply humbleness of Prahlad Maharaj. You know, Bhakti can develop any time. Bhakti can develop any time. Bhakti can develop any time. It never depends upon surrounding situation and, situation and circumstances. Not that. Now, Commentator Sanatan Goswami is speaking. Sanatan Goswami is going to speak one example. Like a man is sleeping for a long time. And in sleeping condition, if you speak so many things, he cannot hear. Because now he is in sleeping. Because we know four different kinds of stage. Jagrat, Sapna, Sushupti. Hello. Jagrat is three kind of condition usually we know. Jagrat means awakening condition. Sapna when you are in dreaming condition, dream coming in you. Sushupti means you are above in a dreaming platform. You cannot see any dream. Follow. Sushupti. So now actually when Sanatana Goswami is giving example. If one man sleeping for a long time, he cannot know what is happening all around. But as soon as he is going to get up, he is going to break his sleeping, then he can see everything what is happening. 
he can get back his usual remembrance he can he can keep a track balance with the past memory and present memory but in sleeping condition not possible follow what i say you know <coughs> so whenever a man going to going to get up from a sleeping uh, his previous memory and present memory all can have a link with each other you know follow what i say and what is more natural what is more natural what is that that bhakti is exclusive if somebody having bhakti prahlad maharaj it not depending upon each factor so is so what according to previous karma phal vrittasur also naraji vrittasur you know in the battlefield in the battlefield in the battlefield you know vrittasur crying and speaking oh prabhu you know i like to see you i already discuss you know ajat paksho ibo matarang khaga वत्सतरम स्तन्न यथा वत्सतरम क्षुदार्था प्रिया प्रिय विषित भूषित विषन्या मन अरविंदा चिद्रीक्षिता एन एन इंद्र इंद्र महाराज इंद्र महाराज वॉज रियली सरप्राइज इंद्र महाराज वॉज रियली सरप्राइज आई एम गिविंग वन बाई वन एग्जाम्पल सो दट वी कैन डिफेंड eh yeah, because pulladma out of humbleness want to pass away all glorification of it. but we are going to catch his lotus feet we are anyway going to catch it why you are speaking this way because we have example in shastra you know out of your humble attitude you like to cheat us eh what is your mood eh oh great vaishnav eka i like to give you reminder when brittasur was in brit battlefield big fighting going on brittasur is almost helpless all his ha hand you know cut you know already cut or it was already cut by you know in indra maharaj and when indra maharaj na uh, bajra and the men i mean the thunder i mean the thunder when the thunder going to fall down from the hand of indra maharaj then britta so thinking well it is not the time to repent it is not the time to repent ho indra you try to you try to collect your weapon which is fall down on ground you know it's going to fall down on ground pick up it is not the time to express your sorrow it is not it is not the time it is not the appropriate time when you can have a em emotional exchange with me it is not the time you can express some emotional mood not that you pick up your bajra thunderbolt and try to strike on me try to you know throw try to throw on me like like other weapons like other weapons like like other weapons anyway the thunderbolt can never go in vain follow it can never go in vain because the mystery the mystery of the mystery of building up the mystery the mystery of building up this weapon i mean the thunderbolt is known to bitasu whenever bitasu speaking so many siddhanta vichar in the battlefield battlefield almost half dead bitasu is almost half dead blood flowing out in a heavy blood flowing flowing out still still half dead but still he is not going to lose his memory of bhakti what he got in his previous life anyway brittasur not going to anyway brittasur not going to forget all his previous memory in previous life or even i can speak about gajendra gajendra this life he has taken the form of elephant by previous life he was great king he has a great king 
follow what I say. So anyway, it is in, in Bhagavatam, eight canto it is written about Gajendra Mokshan. About Gajendra Mokshan it is written, Jajapa Paramam Japyam Pragajan Manu Sikshitam. Clearly, very clearly it is written. Jajapa Paramam Japyam. Follow. Here is in the Dun Maharaj. And Jajapa Paramam Japyam Pragajan Manu Sikshitam. In his previous life, he learned. Eh? He took lesson from Gurudev. Jajapa Paramam Japyam Pragajan Manu Sikshitam. In his previous life, what, what mantra, what mantra, what mantra he got in his previous life, now going to chant. Now you remember. Hello. So, Paralatma, hum, out of humble attitude, is speaking about Vittasura also I speak. So, the same, you know, same you know, thing is applicable for Paralatma. Though Paralatma like to pass away, taking, though Paralatma want to pass away, taking, and, you know, self-glorification, like to pass away, is the usual practice, you know. So, you see, <clears throat> Vrittasur, after watching the mood of Vrittasur, after watching the mood of Vrittasur, exclusive mood, after watching, after watching the exclusive, after watching, after watching the exclusive devotional mood of Vrittasur, the king of heaven, in the Maharaj, gone mad. In the Maharaj, going to pass this remark in front of Vittasur. Though he is the opponent party, fighting going on, still, in the Maharaj was surprised and speaking, Ho Asura, I discover you in Asura form. You are Vittasur. How it is possible for you? to get this kind of exclusive, exclusive devotional mood. I wonder, I wonder how it is possible for you to get this kind of exclusive devotional, you know, mood, which is not even available in heaven, you know, even not in me. In me, if you search, you cannot know how it's possible, whereas I discover you in the, you know, in the, in the form of demon. <laughs> how possible? So, Indra Maharaj asking, you know, Indra Maharaj asking, how it is possible for you? Jad bihayo suram bhavam mahapurushatam gata. You are speaking tatta gata, tatta siddhanta. Vrita sur, I discover you in asura form. By you are speaking so top secret Tattva Siddhanta, which I cannot expect from a demon. Jad Asura Bhava Vihayo, Jad Asura Bhava Vihayo, Mahapurushatam Gataha. How it is possible for you to eliminate all Asura Bhava and to get Bhakti in this very form? You are demon? Yad Asura Bhava. Ayat Asura Bhavam Bihayo Mahapurushatam Gata. You are taking, you are speaking like a great soul. You are speaking like a great soul, elevated soul, great sadhu. How I wonder, I wonder how is possible. I wonder how is possible. This way, we know Sanatan Goswami giving argument. Whenever somebody is sleeping, whenever he is going to break his sleeping, he can make a bridge with the past memory and present memory. Immediately he can take action. So we cannot accept anyway. That is the humble attitude. We must learn something from Prahlad Maharaj. See, it never depends on young, young age or old age or a heretical, but nothing. You know. You know. Sanatan Gosai is going to give another example in his commentary that like uh, Lin said, uh, I forget what is the name. Uh, no. one, one, uh, no. oh, oh. Uh, Mugut, Mug, Mugdal, Mugdal, you know Mugdal? Mugdal. And you know the color of Mugdal is like golden? Eh? No, no? 
So pure gold, if there is some particles of pure gold, if you mix with moong dal, very nice sonamuk, sonamuk golden muk, very nice high quality, very costly. If you are going to, you know, some golden chip, some chips of golden, very small, if you mix with, if you mix with moong dal, sonamuk, golden muk, very costly. Still, <coughs> still, still, if you like to search out, you can very, you can very easily search out because gold, gold particle is very exclusive in nature, very exclusive in nature. So anyway, if I search, I can, you know, I can make it separated from Mung Dal. So, Sanatana Goswami giving argument, say it not, never depend upon you know, old age or a small age, big age, it is simple ha, ha, humbleness, you know, you know. So anyway, next sloka, <coughs> next sloka actually, Prahlad Maharaj now going to defend himself, defend in the same, he is less interested to take any honor or glory. He never want to be identified. He never wanted, he never want to be identified as a pure devotee. Never. That's why he is going to object. Follow what he say. Mahatam upodeshasya balyad bodhottame shati harer bhakto prapetvanam Mahima, Mahimam, and Mahima, Apada, Apada Kanina. What speaking? Ar Bignano, Bignano, Vi Babu, Bignano, Ovi Babu, Bale, Yupo, Deshaha, Shadi, Hitam. What speaking? Bignana avi bhavo baleshu upodeshaha shadi hitam arto prani daya mokshashanangi mokshashanangi karanadicha. What speaking? Bignano bignano avi bhavo baleshu upodeshaha shadi hitam. Arto prani daya mokshasya anangik anangik karanadicha. I mean, what I mean to say? Mahatam upadeshasya balad bodhattame shati harer bhakto upabrittvanam mahima mahima apada apadakanina. Parlatma speaking, a great sadhu like you, Mahajan, Bhavadrisho Mahajan, hmm. like you, hey Gurudev, Parlatma speaking, Gurudev, you are a great exalted sadhu, he is the eternal person of Bhagavan. So, a sadhu, a sadhu like you can help. Develop the consciousness. I know it. Any time, many, many such cases happen. You meet with one hunter, you are successful changing. You meet with one, you know, you know, murderer. Murderer, you know who? Balmiki Bal 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 Muni, Ratnakar Doshu in Raman. Ratnakar Doshu is a Doshu demon. Is killing people. And going to you know take away everything. So he was changed by the mercy of Nara. And in 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 the way of Allahabad, Naraji meet with one hunter, he was changed. Haridas Thakur was successful to change the heart of Pros Lakshahira. In Jaiva Dharma, you can find Vaishnav Das, you know, was then in Varanasi. By the mercy, by the mercy, not mercy, 
only by the darshan, only by the darshan of a pure sadhu, only by the darshan and hearing Harinam from lotus feet of that pure sadhu, his heart was totally changed. He became Krishna Bhakta, I mean Chaitanya Bhakta, his great devotee. So why not possible? So, anyway, Prahladma is not going to accept any glorification anyway. Now Prahladma is speaking, what is the credit? Oh Gurudev, what is the credit lying with me? It is your credit. You are great devotee. If you are going to advise to somebody, surely he is going to change. So actually, uh, point is that, Gurudev, point is that, a great elevated sadhu like you can change the heart of anybody wanted so by advice, can help develop consciousness also, and can start Hari Bhajan. I am not going to ignore this point. I am not going to ignore this point. If I ignore directly, then surely I am going to insult you because you are my guru. I received so many advice from you. Now point is that a great devotee is like you. By your advice, it is quite natural that common people can change their heart, can develop their consciousness. But I was so small boy. I was so small boy. Even I couldn't realize the gravity of your speech, Harikatha. Follow. I was inside the womb. I was inside the womb of my mother. Kwayadhu. I was just inside the womb of my mother. From there, I was hearing all Harikatha from you. So I thought that, that stage was not mature stage. That fetus was very small fetus. So how, you know, possible for me? You know, I know you are at yeah, that time I received your but that was not so, maturity was not there. Even I couldn't take birth that time, I was inside the womb of my mother. So how we can develop, you know, how I can understand your efficacy, pure efficacy, you know, pure, you know, achara and everything. <clears throat> Though we know small boys, kids, they are usually unaffected by any, 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 you know, bad situation because they are innocent. But still, I know one innocent boy like me, that time I was five years boy, very small kids, their surrounding, surrounding situation cannot touch them, you know, dirty situation, they are a small boy, innocent. So how how you can expect how you can ex how you can expect a small boy like me can learn all etiquette and everything from you whereas i was already inside the womb of my mother you know and that type mercy humbleness this this kind of qualities they are not getting maturity inside a small boy they are small boy they don't understand what is humbleness what is maturity? Small boy, you know, maturity not developed. What is humbleness? You know, what is, uh, you know, Sastra Vicha? Anyway, Prahlad Maharaj, you know, Prahlad Maharaj is going to speak, you know, defend himself. He is less interested to take all the, you know, glorifications, you know, done by Naraji Maharaj. A small boy like me, four, five years boy, how can develop the charity, humbleness, you know, how can compa compa com compassion, compassion from other boys as you are glorifying. I was very compassionate to those Asura boys. How it is possible? I don't need, I, even I don't know the meaning of compassionate, compassion. But whereas you are going to speak, I was very compassionate to my uh, friends, Asura boys. But that small age, you know, how possible? That time, this kind of qualities, you know, not getting maturity, the like humbleness or compassion. What I understand about this, that time I was four years boy, or five years boy. Oh, Gurudev, you know, 
you are speaking that way and you are going to glorify me that way that ho oh, prahlad maharaj ho oh, prahlad you are great i know you are going to glorify me you are going to glorify ho oh, prahlad you are great nishingade wanted to give you so much benediction and in place of you if you know anybody there he could have accepted but you are not going to accept you are going to glorify me you are going to glorify me that way but you see i was a innocent boy what i understand about moksha mukti what i understand about other benediction nothing is very immature stage what i can understand about my you know i want i i know nothing so you are going to glory glorify me that way eh follow it is quite natural it is quite natural it is quite natural those who are busy it is quite natural those who are busy with krishna bhakti automatically they are going to avoid all envious attitude or no any lucrative any lucrative things they can avoid because they only understand the glories of the lotus feet of krishna and guru vishnu is quite natural so you are going to glorify me what is the credit lying with me ho oh, gurudev what is the credit lying with me what i have done i even i don't understand what is humbleness compassion it what about benediction what i understand no maturity there in me so i don't even understand what is you know moksha or different benediction uh, so like a child i told to nishingadev prabhu i want to get bhakti somehow by your mercy i i was bound to speak out but that was not credit that was not a credit for me anyway you know anyway so mahatam upadeshasya mahata <coughs> mahatam upadeshasya balad bodhatvame shati harer bhakto prabhitvanam mahima pad kanina विज्ञानो अवि विज्ञानो अवि भवो बालेशु उपदेशः सदीहितम् आर्तो आर्तो प्रणिदया मोक्षशानंगि करणा दि करणा दिचा हे आई वाज यू नो अवॉइडिंग द यू नो बेनेडिक्शन एंड मोक्ष एवरीथिंग फ्रॉम व्हाट इज माय क्रेडिट इट्स नथिंग we know our whole world is busy with chatur varga dharma artho kam moksha they are busy i you know those who are busy with krishna bhakti those who are busy with krishna bhakti it is quite natural they can avoid taking any benediction from bhagwan they can ask bhakti is quite natural so what is the mature what, what is the you know my credit by this way simply i wanted simply i wanted to avoid chatur varga dharma artha kam mukha etc i never wanted to accept this is not the symptom ho oh, gurudev this cannot be the this cannot be the symptom so that you can prove that i was a great devotee this cannot be the symptom symptom is seva symptom is seva na but you are speaking you know you you know your hey gurudev is speaking you speaking your advice your advice in front of asura balakas you are avoiding taking any benediction your humble everything going to prove that you are great devotee you cannot just pass away but pollagma anyway going to defend himself pollagma is going to defend himself you know that there was small age is quite natural no maturity i cannot deserve any credit for that is quite natural so those who are those who are usually engaged in hari bhakti is quite natural from them they can know hey, what is the speciality you find with me and my advice in front of asura balaks 
my avoiding taking any benediction, all you know, all very, 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 very cheap thing, you know, not so, not so, you know, valuable. Follow what I say. Krishna Swanu Graho Apebhyo Nanu Miyate Sattamai Sa Chavir Bhavati Sriman Adhik Krittvaiva Sevakam And those are the, those were, those are the symptoms. Pradhatma is sitting. Those are the symptoms on the basis of which you want to establish my Krishna Bhakti. But I am sure, Gurudev, pure devotees like you should not, eh, should not be satisfied, should not, you know, express this kind of, how possible. You are going to establish, you are going to establish that I am enjoying full mercy of Bhagavan. But any great great sadhu, they are not going to pass, you know, this kind of, you know, Remark, they always want to search out, they always want to search out the seva mood. Especially in my whole life, what seva I have done? Gurudev, you are going to glorify me. It is unbearable for me. I think it is joking. I feel shy. I like to jump into the ocean of, you know, you know, humble, in a sinus, where I can go. You are going to glorify me. Eh? What, what bhakti I have done in my life? Those were great, great devotees, elevated souls, those acharyas, they are going to pass remark on any jivatma on the basis of his seva mood. But Gurudev, what seva mood you have, what seva mood you have seen in me? You have seen any seva mood? Only I am closing my eyes out of full Tension, I am going to think, Hari Om, Hari Om, O Prabhu. Out of tension. Not if tension is there, then bhakti cannot be you know, pure. You see, Krishna Swanu Graho Opi Opi Abhyo Nanu Miyati Sattamai Sa Chavir Bhavati Siman Adhikrtaivo Sevakam. The mercy of mercy of Krishna, mercy of Krishna on somebody. This is not the way of calculation. Maybe, maybe you love me. I am your disciple. You have some affection that I am your disciple. So maybe I am your son, my disciple. So I think that's why you are going to glorify me. But actually, O oh Gurudev, you think over and again, there cannot be any reason for why you can glorify me. I have done no seva in my whole life. What seva I have done? Only I am closing eyes. Oh, Hari Om, Hari Om. I am thinking about Hari. But I have done no seva. And usually those great devotees, they are always going to pass judgment on the basis of seva mood. If they are going to find that seva mood, is, seva mood is there, the more, the more the seva mood, the more the seva mood is there, the more they, the more they are satisfied. The more they feel satisfied, feeling satisfied. It depends upon seva. In my whole life, what seva I have done? I have nothing, no seva done. Now, Sanatan Goswami is going to push nice argument. Very nice. Try to remember. Bala Maharaj, Prahlad Maharaj, out of humble attitude, want to pass away. He never want to be identified as a pure devotee. That's why he want to defend himself. But we know, we can speak, Ho oh, Prahlad Maharaj, you are a great devotee. According to Bhagavatam, According to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, we know Navavida Bhakti. Eh? Sravanam Kirtanam, eh? Sravanam Kirtanam, Pada Sevanam, everything Navavida Bhakti we know. How we can say, Prahlad Maharaj, how, we can, how you can say that you have, not, you have not done any seva? 
smaran bhakti to remember bhagwan it is also one fold of bhakti out of nine fold so how you can pass away how you can cheat us eh savanam kirtanam vishnu sparanam pad sevanam eh savanam kirtanam vishnu sparanam pad all interlink ho prahlad maharaj you are great devotee how you can pass away we can we 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 understand you it is your humble attitude anyway we know you because we know that you know siddhanta we know it for sure we know that you know siddhanta but you are speaking this way to defend yourself to prove that you are not a devotee is quite natural but we are not going to deviate from the track of siddhanta which we know you are great devotee any amount of your argument you you can try to defend yourself i am we are not going to pass we know that you get out of nine folds of devotee savanam kirtanam vishnu sparanam pad seva so vishnu sparanam so you are not doing any bhakti seva how you can say you cannot say that way you cannot cheat us that way please don't try to cheat us that way so now prahlad ma is going to defend again well you can say well you can say that it was uh, it was one fold of bhakti out of nine fold but try to remember what i speak prahlad ma speaking well you can try to prove that out of nine folds of bhakti this all to that i know that i know but what i told you try to understand what is that what is that <coughs> what is that <coughs> what is that because prahlad ma speaking i know i know prahlad ma speaking i know you are going to prove that smaran bhakti is one out of nine folds of bhakti i know you like to establish that i am a pure devotee but actually not that because you you try to understand my situation you try to understand my situation prahlad ma speaking i was remembering bhagwan okay savanam savanam kirtanam vishnu smaranam padase i know but my smaran bhakti was full of problem different kind of danger my heart was full of tension I know you like to specifically speaking. It is one out of nine folds of bhakti that I know, but try to understand my situation. That time I was full of tension, anxiety, full of tension. Prahlad Maharaj again, Prahlad Maharaj again, out of humble attitude, want to pass away, but we like to arrest him. Arrest his lotus feet. we know prahlad ma do never want to take any you know any la puja patishtha nothing now prahlad ma is giving argument what i discussed right now hanuma dadi battasho hanuma hamo hanuma dadi battasho kapi seva kritasti na param विघ्नाकूले चित्ते स्मरण क्रिए क्रियते मया हनुमद हनुमदादि हनुमदादि मैंने मदादि मीन एक्सेट्रा हनुमान प्रवृत्ति स्पेशली वी कैन काउंट द नेम ऑफ प्रहलाद माय इन दास द ड्यूटी ऑफ दास इज टू डू सेवा सो प्रहलाद माय वेन टू स्पेसिफिकली स्पीक स्पेसिफिकली पॉइंट आउट I have never done seva like Hanuman Ji Maharaj or like Hanuman. So many, you know. Hanuma Dadi Bhattasho Kapi Seva Kritasti No. I have done never no seva, direct seva. And also, you can point out the Smarana Ka Bhakti is also it, it is also seva. but this kind of seva done by me in a very critical situation what is that param vignan kule chitte 
स्मरणम क्रियते मया व्हाट स्पीकिंग परम विघ्नाकूले चित्ते स्मरणम क्रियते मया ओके आई हैव डन स्मरण बट माय हार्ट वाज फुल ऑफ टेंशन एंड एंजाइटी सो दिस इज एक्चुअली नॉट भक्ति हनुमा दादी बत्तशो कापी सेवा कृतास्ती न परम विघ्नाकूले चित्ते स्मरण क्रियते मया ओह वेरी नाइस आर्गुमेंट पुलाद मा इज वेरी क्लेवर बिकॉज एक्चुअली दोज वर डिवोटी एक्चुअली दोज वर डिवोटी दे आर वेरी क्लेवर इन बेंगोली यू डोंट नो बेंगोली दैट्स वाई कैन नॉट स्पीक और आई कैन स्पीक एंड ट्रांसलेट जे जन कृष्ण भक्ते जे जन कृष्ण भजे से आय भर चतुर इट इज विटिन इन बेंगोली कीर्तन एवरी वे दोज वर डूइंग कृष्ण भजन दे आर सो क्लेवर सो क्लेवर सो क्लेवर दे कैन चीट भगवान ऑल्सो दे कैन चीट भगवान दे सो क्लेवर सो प्रहलाद मार इज क्लेवर वट टू स्पीक मोर अबाउट प्रहलाद मार इवन इन कीर्तन बेंगोली कीर्तन जे जन कृष्ण भजे से आर एक्चुअली दैट ग्रेट डिवोटी एन ही राइटिंग इन प्रेम विवर्त प्रेम विवर्त इज रिटिन बाय वन फ्रेंड ऑफ किस चैतन्य महाप्रभु है नो फॉलो है नो सो he like to pass away we like to arrest this is the fighting between devotees and devotee <laughs> so two devotees fighting what is the ground what is the reason if you don't understand you are not if you are not rasik bhakta you can misunderstand jagadanand pandit is a great devotee he is speaking this way those who are going to do krishna bhajan they are very very clever they know how to cheat a non devotee they know how to make fool of bhagwan <laughs> they are very clever very clever so is quite natural bolan ma speaking this is quite natural je jan krishna bhaje sai bhar chatur they are very clever you know hanuma dadi batasho kapi सेवा कृतास्ति न परम विघ्नाकूले चित्ते स्मरण क्रियते मया ओके यू कैन पॉइंट आउट स्मरण का भक्ति डन बाय मी बाय दैट वाज आल्सो फुल ऑफ टेंशन माय हार्ट वाज फुल ऑफ टेंशन इफ फुल ऑफ टेंशन देन हाउ आई कैन डू भक्ति सो एनीवे गुरुदेव दैट वाज नॉट माय भक्ति एक्चुअली दैट वाज नॉट माय भक्ति डोंट ट्राई टू स्पीक दैट वे गुरुदेव प्लीज प्लीज I don't like to take any credit. It was childhood, innocent boy, having no idea, no proficiency, no idea, not whatever. By the inspiration of Bhagwan came inside my heart. I went on speaking. That is not my credit. You cannot speak that way. It is not my credit actually. It is not my credit, Guru Dev. You are speaking big way. You know. So. We know it for sure. Though Pollad Maal is going to defend himself, but we know it for sure, hundred percent, according to the sloka of in Sastra Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu, we have documents that Pollad Maharaj is the Acharya of Saran Aksha Bhakti. Let him, let him defend himself, but we are also going to defend ourselves. He like to cheat us. So Vishnu, Shravane, Parikshit, Abhavat, Bhaya, Saki, Kirtani, Pralada, Smarani, Tadangi, Sevani, Lakshmi, Prithu, Pujani, Akrurastu, Abhivandani, Kapipatir, Dashi, Atho, Shakshi, Arjuna, Sarvashvatma, Nivedani, Bali, Rabhut, Krishna, Ti, Desham, Param. वन ऐसे श्री विष्णु श्रवणे परीक्षित अभवत बैया सखी कीर्तने प्रहलाद स्मरणे तदंग्री भजने लक्ष्मी पृथु पूजने 
अक्रोरस्तु अभिवंदने कपिपतिर दाशे अथो साक्षे अर्जुन सर्वस्वात्म निवेदने बलिर अहूत कृष्णात्तिषा परम वाचकुर्भ के पास सिंधु व्यवस्था पचितान पावन भो वैष्णवभ्यो नमो नमः